congratulations on being named one of the watch and congratulations on Heartstopper. But to, to get here, you've already done a massive amount of work. So what kind of key decisions and choices, because there must be so many choices along the way, and how do you know which ones are kind of the right ones to make? Um, I guess you won't really know until the time's right. And for me, it's all about trusting my instincts and trusting my gut feeling always um, and that's what I did when I got Heartstopper and when I got Doctor Who I trusted my gut and I went for it because I think as as people you know we're so used to kind of like turning a blind eye to opportunities and for me I just I've always pushed myself to push myself out of my comfort zone and that's what I've done with everything I've done so far so yeah. And even in the time that you've been acting have you seen the, the way stories are told develop and improve? and that we're telling better stories now about our culture, our society, and the things that we want to see? I think it's definitely happening. You know, the shows that give representation to a community and shows like Heartstopper um, are happening. And I think, you know, with Elle in the world of TV and film now, um, the possibilities are endless, basically. And I hope to see more trans roles out there, whether they are a 16-year-old girl in high school or if they're like, an elderly person. I just want to see more queer roles out there. I think it's so important. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys! Hey You Guys, huh? Is that from the Goonies? Nice. Hey!